So the unique thing about Midmark is, you know, we not just sell these amazing pieces of equipment that really do extend the lives of our patients, but we provide that clinical training and support to the clinics that are investing in this because a very big focus of Midmarks is patient care and we want to extend the pet's lives for as long as we possibly can. And so that's why we've created these training programs that support both our anesthesia and monitoring equipment as well as our dental equipment so that we can really help them achieve the highest level of patient care for all of their procedures. A lot of people have the understanding, oh great, we got this new equipment, we're going to break it out and we're just gonna go. Um, there is a little bit of a learning curve with that, so having somebody come in who knows what they're doing, um, training the full staff on how to take those images, redirect things, how to fix mistakes, is super important. I am able to take x-rays on everything from a two pound Maltese to a 180 pound Irish Wolfhound with a number two sensor. Because I've had the training, the appropriate training and practice. Dentistry and anesthesia go hand in hand, so it's really important uh, to have proper training for both technologies. We need to monitor our patients during anesthesia. We need to be able to understand if we're going into a potential critical moment with a patient or be able to recognize um, during an anesthetic procedure if a patient is becoming light, whether it's a, it's a blood pressure issue, a CO2 issue, um, those sorts of things. And so it's really important to have that kind of training. When it comes to dentistry, um, you know, veterinarians and technicians do not receive much training in dentistry when they go to tech school or veterinary school. And so one of the greatest things that go along with a purchase is training. You want that purchase, you want to have somebody come into your practice and teach you how to use that system. Teach the whole staff how to use that system so that you can hit the ground running. Um, because there is a learning curve with this. This isn't a type of technology that you can invest in and get it in your hospital and then it's just gonna be quick for you. It's always best to stay current and to uh, any time that we can have knowledge, especially in anything veterinary medicine, but especially with anesthesia, we're more empowered and we can minimize the risk of anesthesia as much as possible for our patients. All of our dental patients are under general anesthesia. So on that aspect, you have the patient's life in your hands that you need to monitor and make sure that you're aware of what plane of anesthesia they're in. You have a very expensive piece of equipment in their mouth, so if they're on a light plane of anesthesia, you don't want them to mistakenly chomp down and bite that sensor and ruin it. So having that anesthesia training, you know what plane of anesthesia that patient is in, and it can make your whole procedure run smoothly. So many times the front office staff gets left out of continuing education learning events. And something that is really important to recognize is that those client care folks are the ones that have the most communication to the clients on a daily basis. And so we need to get them trained up. And that's what our best practices workshop is about. We get everybody on the same page with the importance of an oral health care plan. And we get everybody walking the same walk and talking the same talk when it comes to dentistry so that we can all be on the same page when educating the clients and it really does help increase the compliance of dentistry procedures in the hospital and as a result of that it does increase revenue in the hospital and so then that additional revenue can be put back into the practice or investing into the teammates to learn more in other areas of the hospital.